All right. We're going to go back to Omori. There's got to be a better way to do this. Um... Yeah. I... Since they're apparently still not putting the content warning, I'm going to put on my serious voice. <clears throat> Read this. Give me a moment. I forgot what I was going to say. Uh... Warning. The following is intended for mature audiences only. <clears throat> Viewer discretion is advised. This game contains depictions of depression, anxiety, and suicide and may not be suitable for all, for all audiences. It also contains bright flashing imagery that may cause discomfort and or seizures for those with photosensitive epilepsy. Viewer discretion is advised. Peaceful piano music in the background. <laughs> Uh, where was I? Oh, yeah, I was here. We're going to Otherworld. We're already in Otherworld, actually. Did they do the picnic? Yeah. The thingy is closed. Okay. Let's see what our friend the mailbox has. Yes, yes. Hello, valued customer. Welcome to my shop. Please buy something. <laughs> Lunch. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna get a ton of these anyway. Uh, buy me some s'mores. Loading here. Your, your friend smile warmly behind you. Nothing new there. Okay. Let's fight Pluto. This guy looks pretty intimidating. Do you want to disturb him? This is a mistake. I forget again. Sad beats happy. Yeah. So, Aubrey, I want you to... No, no, no. You're going to attack. Also going to be 
attack. <laughs> what a splendid show of force. I knew this was a mistake. Okay, you're going to use Life Jam on Cal. That's not very good. Do you want to retry? Yes. Okay. I don't remember what I'm doing here. We're going to stab. Maybe we should focus on the arms. I don't know. We are going to attack. We are also going to attack Castro Mori. Ooh, 
good lord. Okay. You gotta be getting close. Aha! Amori's party was victorious. You gained 450 EXP. You got 348 clams. Amori grew to level 5. Learn Bread Slice. Nice. I grew to level 5. Cal grew to level 5. Hero grew to level 5. Hmm. Hmm. Not bad. Okay then. Ah, oh, crap. Forgot my camera at home. What's a good camping trip if I can't take any pictures? Junior just doesn't know how to stay put. All he wants to do is go outside. Sorry to bother you, but have you seen my son anywhere? He looked away for less than a second and he's gone and ran off. Do you keep an eye out for me? You'll know when you see him. Looks just like me. Haha. <laughs> A happy family. Bookcase filled with DVDs. This family records everything. That's the same thing. Can't interact with that. Press A to go in. I'm small. The world's smallest centaur. Look at all my awards. Littlest centaur. First place. Most horse. Second place. <laughs> Tiniest centaur. First place. Miniest centaur. First place. Smallest centaur, first place. Littlest centaur, first place. Littlest centaur, for, wait. Why are, why are these the same? Idiest, bittiest centaur, first place. Bookcase. It's a little dusty. Uh, 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 achoo! <clears throat> oh, I probably should have healed. Let's just murder this dust bunny. That's the Aubrey. Oh, or not. <laughs> That was unnecessary. <clears throat> All right, let's go back to Mari. Ah, yes, some lovely space tube food. Would you like to eat some? Yes. You and your friends feel like new. Did I talk to you? Gumbo, happy. So many humans today. You guys are always such big fans of space travel. Let's see. This place used to be a pristine wildlife reserve, but due to a recent boom in tourism, it's starting to accumulate a lot of trash. Pick up your trash, people. It's not that hard. You got can. That recycling machine just gave me a cool prize for cycling some cans. Recycling does pay off. What a concept. Keep... 
keep forgetting that I have to, like, press A to go in. Very obnoxious sounding song that's playing from the spoon box. Hey, I want to talk to you. Hi, I'm Tessie, and as you probably noticed, I love Sweetheart. I got every piece of merchandise she's ever released. I got Sweetheart posters, figures, stickers, shirts, her entire discography, and anything else you can think of. I'm certain you won't find a more thorough collection anywhere else in the world. Calling me a super fan is an understatement. I am the ultimate fan. Let me tell you about the time I almost met Sweetheart. We just happened to be eating at the same restaurant. It was fate, I think. We ordered the same meal, too. Not like I totally saw what she ordered and copied her or anything. I even tried to pay for her meal, but I had just bought a newly released Sweetheart life-size statue the day earlier and couldn't afford to. Which I guess ended up being a good thing since that girl turned out to be some regular girl wearing a costume that kind of looked like Sweetheart's anyway. Not like I couldn't tell in the first place. Only a poser fan would ever mistake a regular person for Sweetheart. Okay. Table full of merchandise of an obnoxious looking person. Bookcase full of books about an obnoxious looking person. Statue made in the likeness of an obnoxious looking person. A surprisingly normal bed. <laughs> I get the, uh, the impression that Amori doesn't really care for Sweetheart that much. Just, just my, uh, just call it my gamer's intuition. A recycling machine. What would you like to recycle? Can. You put a can into the recycling machine. Recycling machine dispensed five clams. Thanks for doing your part in keeping the environment clean. I don't want to go up there yet. That's plot. A band of space pirates has been camping out here for a long time now. I hear that the captain suddenly decided he wasn't going to travel anymore, so half the crew took a ship and left. this way. Best character in the game. Cheap. Other world lake. Cheap, cheap. Other world campsite. Cheap, cheap, cheap. Junkyard. Oh, goodness. Am I in your way? I'm so sorry. I'll move over. Move over. Okay, yeah, thanks, Snaily. That is an enemy. Come on. Oh, this is straight through. Thought I had to go down. <laughs> Jeez, give me a morning at least, will ya? I don't get visitors very often, you know. Oh, hey. Why are you here, and could you be a real pal and help me get the stuff that's on this list? Did you get all that? Everything you need to find should be in the junkyard. Thanks, buddy. I owe you one. Huh? What do you mean it was too fast for you to read? <sighs> Fine. Here's a list you can look at for as long as you want to. Whatchamacallit? Doohickey. Dinamabob. Okay. You got a strange list. You got it down this time? Expect I'll be seeing you again soon. get for that class. Coffee? You 
that starfruit soda. Something this way. Man, all these traffic cones. I think that Sprout Mulroy wants to be left alone. You got blanket. Protects you from monsters. Defense plus one, heart plus ten. I'll give it to Hero. Hero needs a blanket. Actually, what does Aubrey have? Bracelet. I wish I could fast forward through this in real life. You know what? I'm gonna come back to that. During our hike just now, I noticed a face invented into a cliff. I wonder what that's all about. I'm pooped after that rigorous hike. I just know I won't be able to feel my legs tomorrow. Oh, there's Ducky. Ducky Jr. Stars sure are pretty, huh? I'd rather lose myself staring into the sky like this. Back on my planet, you can hardly see any stars. When I grow up, I want to be a space captain. I'll be able to have this view all the time. Oh, shoot. How long have I been here? Mom and Dad are probably super worried about me. I'd better head home, quick. A cool duffel bag. Some cool energy drinks. Cup of cool soda. Another cool duffel bag. Turn on the boombox. I don't know how to read that. Children, we're gonna explore. We're adventurers. We're explorers. Wait, no, we're on an adventure. Would you like to moonwalk? <laughs> this is the best part of the game right here. Yes. Omocat did not need to put this in the game, but they did. Everyone say thank you, Omocat. Space Bunny. Cattail Field. Keep other world campsite. Sheep frozen lake. Loamy. Loam loam. Loamy loam is loamy. Cool. Uh okay, well 
I can't get that. I have to fight this thing. It is angry. Yet. Head butted. It's not dead yet. There we go. Thanks, hero. Oh, I forgot to do the thing, the thingy. Do you want to go fishing with your friends? Yes. You hooked up tofu. Fish. You hooked up a real fish and then threw it back into the lake. You want to go fishing with your friends? Yes. Let's see if I'm going to catch anything good. Ah, uh, yeah, I should kill these bunnies. You hooked up an O and threw it back into the lake. Well, Cal's turn. Cal, what did you do? Isn't this place pretty? Snow comes down so slowly, but all the pieces seem to fall right into place in the end. It reminds me to be patient. Hey, I know. We should go ice skating one day. Doesn't that sound fun, Amori? You want to have a picnic with your friends? Yes. Really, Mari? Shaved ice in this weather. What's wrong with that, Hiram? 
it's so convenient. Shaved ice is way easier to come by than snow cones. What's the difference between shaved ice and snow cones anyway? Well, realistically, there's not much of a difference. Snow cones just have larger pieces of ice than shaved ice. Larger pieces of ice, huh? Is that why snow cones are so much more expensive? I... I don't know, Cal. I can't really answer that one. Time to murder a bunny. Six and learned counter. Oh, spooky ghost. Spooky. You got light jam. Message in a bottle. You want to read it? When the moon hits your eye like a big pizza pie. That's a mori. When the moon hits your eye like a big pizza pie. That's a mori. You completed the message and threw the bottle back into the lake. Cool. Get out of my way. This isn't very good. show you. Oh, 
Oh my god. Spider on the moon. Slice. Yeah. You got fries. Oh. This is the best battle music, I think. the dirt. Doesn't seem to notice you. Oh, I need to be able to... Yeah, I can't do this yet. Okay, I guess we're going to the plot. First, let's get some lovely space tube food. best. Halt, children. You are now entering the vicinity of the captain of the space pirates, the master of the solar system, the prince of the universe, the one and only Captain Sp- I mean, uh, you're entering the house of space boyfriend. Whoa, the captain of the space pirates lives here? That's awesome! I want to be a space pirate too! Yeah, well, so did I. Once. Space boyfriend doesn't do much these days, so most of the space pirates got fed up and left with the main ship. Just us stragglers here doing all of space boyfriend's chores and whatever. Yesterday, me and the guy spent the day cleaning and throwing away all of his trash. <sighs> I didn't leave my old job for this. I ain't no babysitter. Oh, I'm sorry. That sounds awful. Maybe we can talk some sense into him. Oh, I wouldn't do that if I were you. Captain Space... I mean, Space Boyfriend's got two sides to him, you see. Well, we should at least try. You never know. Might know something about how to find Basil. Or maybe he knows where to find my pet rock, Hector. Yeah, sure. That, too. What are we waiting for? Let's go see him already. 
Sorry about your job, sir. It'll get better soon, I promise. <sighs> Thank you, little lady. I sure hope so. Hey, who are you? Yeah, maybe I should use the, uh, the arrow keys or the D-pad. Ah, the view here is spectacular. Yeah, if you say so. Ah, eh, radio towers are pretty cool, yeah. Squawk! Things have been so boring around here ever since Captain Space... I, I mean, Space Boyfriend took charge of Space Pirates. I mean, look what Space Boyfriend's done with the old Captain's ship. Captain Pinkbeard would never approve of this. Buddy. Sucks that you had to come at a time like this. Captain Space... I mean, Space Boyfriend hasn't left his bed since... She... Stopped coming around. Things are a little tough now, but I don't care what anyone says, pal. I believe in the Captain. Space Boyfriend. What can we do for you, bro? Why won't you leave your bed? Nope, I wanted to talk to you. All I hear lately are the rest of the crew complaining about being bored. Am I the only one who kind of enjoys cleaning around here? <coughs> that didn't work. <coughs> Tried to snore, but I ended up choking myself. Mm. Captain Space, I mean, Space Boyfriend doesn't look so good. Yeah, I remember I'm gonna try and give Hero a British accent for some reason. Don't worry, I'll handle this. Hey, Space Boyfriend, wake up! Kel. What? <coughs> My precious. Sweetheart. Aw, he sounds so sad. There must be some way to help him. <laughs> oh, my sweetheart. Where have you run off to now? Oh no, not again. Space Boyfriend's feeling the heavy blues. Here, my guy, and just cheer you right up. Why isn't anything plain? Oh no. The boombox. It's empty. It's never gonna wake up now. Or even worse, it's gonna wake up angry. Oh man, oh man. Look at that special mixtape B. Someone must have thrown away his special mixtape when we were cleaning. What's the big deal? It's just a cassette, right? Well, you see, whenever Space Boyfriend is away from Sweetheart, he gets very sad and lies in bed all day. The only way to snap him out of it is by playing a special mixtape. There's only one in the universe like it. Oh, I see. Space Boyfriend isn't sick. He's lovesick. <sighs> if Space Boyfriend stays like this, the once great coalition of space pirates will be lost for eternity. Oh, man, that sucks. Oh, let's go. <laughs> I love Cal. Wait, where are you going? We should help him out. You should know that it really sucks to lose something important to you. Don't you dare bring Hector into this. I'm talking about when you stole my stuffed toy. Huh? I don't remember anything like that. <coughs> Sweetheart, my perfect goddess, <coughs> my sweet, jelly-filled donut. I think he's getting worse. 
What should we do, Omori? Should we help him? Thanks, my guys. I really appreciate it. Here, take this. You got Junkyard Key. This key unlocks the Junkyard. Wouldn't have guessed. Special mixtape should be somewhere in there. You can get there through the secret entrance to Space Boyfriend's backyard. Pretty convenient, eh? Hope the captain feels better soon. <laughs> Do I want to fight the Earth? Let's do that later. <sighs> We've already done it now, dude. Hope the captain won't be too mad when we tell him his favorite planet is missing. You know how he gets when he's angry. Buddy, you're not supposed to call him captain anymore. You have to call him space boyfriend, remember? Oh yeah, that's right. You know, dude, sometimes I wonder if we're even space pirates anymore. Ever since that sweetheart came along, we haven't done anything for him. We should just quit and get real jobs. Don't talk nonsense, buddy. What was life for us if not the space pirate life? I'm sure, the captain will come to his senses one day and we'll all fly again. We just have to believe in him. <sighs> Thanks, dude. You're always there when I need you.
Okay, I think I'm gonna give you the, uh... Give you a little bit more. My good men, I am looking for some art. Fear not, for I will know when I have found it. Okay. You use the junkyard key. Got granola bar. You got rubber band. Nice. You got gold watch. It, it doesn't do anything, right? I have to go to the equipment menu. I was hoping to just look at it. Most definitely, probably not really made of gold. Useless in battle. Okay. So this is the junkyard, eh? Time to start digging. What are we looking for again? Space Boyfriend Special Mixtape. Righto. Hey, look, I found a can. You got a can. <sighs> I guess that's a start. Good old Cal. You got a glass bottle. Oh. Cal's digging through trash. Hell, didn't find anything. Uh, huh. I'm having toys. Candy lion. Cardboard. You got air horn. Oh, perfect. I love those. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. You got Dynamo Bob. Aw, oh, man. Looks like there's a big block of junk in the way. You might even call it. The roadblock. Get it. Not to worry, everyone. Big old block is nothing compared to my swing. Hey, Amori, you know how you can cut roots and traffic cones? Well, you're not the only one with a special ability around here. I, for one, can smash large blocks out of the way. Cal and Hero have their own special abilities, too. Well, I'm not so sure, sure about Cal. <laughs> Just make me the leader by selecting tag in the player menu or by holding X. I'll get rid of this hunk of junk easy peasy. And Aubrey. Bonk.
Okay, I'm not going to do that. You got can. You got glass bottle. Excuse me, Mr. Dial-Up. Y'all stick into your tramp. Y'all find a can of cherry soda. Focus on the mixtape. Uh, you can do dial up. You're going to use hook on yourself. As a hero. Flower puzzle. The gate is locked. You can probably open it using the junkyard key. I thought I had one of those. Hey, Mr. Conveyor Bot, switch up those conveyor belts for us already. <laughs> Rude person. You can't just yell orders at people, Kel. Jeez, have some tact, will ya? Now, Nick, there's no need to fuss. I'll handle this one. Tag me a moment. See, I think when I played it on the computer, I was still using the Pro Controllers, but I had a different scheme. <clears throat> Greetings, Sir Conveyor My companions and I require your assistance in changing the directions of your conveyors. Will you and your friends please help us? Ah, hmm, nice person. Okay. Always check the toilet. You got ramen. Vending machine. Buy a tasty soda for 100 clams? Sure. I don't even remember what that does. Everything is sold out. What does that do? Goes 50% of your share, that's not bad. Oh no. You got Comet Hammer.
pretty sure you don't actually need to be have hero in the front to do this. Ah, uh, this is so annoying. Oh no! 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 no. Yeah, I'm gonna use I'm gonna use the D-pad here. So I don't do that again. Hey kids, I'm the life jam guy. I sell a life jam. It really works. Like a free demo? Sure. It doesn't matter because it's gonna kill us all anyway. Oh my god. Use life jam. It really works. You got life jam. You got life jam. You got life jam. Explains the benefits of life jam. Enjoy your free samples. Goodbye now. Haha. <laughs> How did you like my free demo? Haha, <laughs> I'm kidding. I know you loved it. Oh, I see you're still hurt. No worries, I will heal you, haha. -ha. You and your friends feel like new. Very good, yes. Now, would you like to buy some life jam? It only cost you 250 clams. You got life jam. Life jam! It really works. Thank you, life jam guy. Fine. Take the slow way. Use the junkyard key. someone familiar. Cool. <laughs> you got life jam.
tell him to disappear for you. Hope you're all enjoying yourselves. Third out of junk here and found a perfectly good roasted chicken. See you, Mari? Cleaning has its benefits. Yep. I need to set an example for my sometimes messy little brother. You just found that in the junkyard? I'm not sure. <laughs> This place is so gross and stinky. My nose can't take it anymore. What's the rush, Aubrey? There's so much treasure around. I'm gonna swipe as many cans as I can find. Oh, then afterwards we should recycle them at a recycling machine. I'm sure we passed by them well, I'm on the way to Captain Smith. I mean, Space Boyfriend's place. Ugh, forget cans. We gotta find that special mixtape and get out of here. Hang in there, Aubrey. You'll get past this. Anything. Just think about all the good recycling we'll do for the environment. Yeah, come on, Aubrey. Do it for the environment. I should probably save. Batteries. I should fight this thing. I don't think I've fought one of these before. Cow finds a can.
This makes sense. Like slaps. one of those anyway. Let's try throwing something at it. I'm sure that'll work. That platform there looks like a good place to throw from. Tag me. I got this. You tagged Cal. He's like 12. My, uh, I think my voice for Scout, for Cal, is gonna be Scout. I'm gonna try and imitate Scout, TF2. You got a glass bottle. Oh. That's not how you run away. Go find a piece of tofu. Angry beats. 
sad. Confetti. Oh, perfect. You got poetry book. Hickey. I do. I need all of them. You got jacks. Yeah, I want to get all of them, actually. Get all the 
the stuff. Banana smoothie. That sounds kind of good. You got binoculars. And a sparkler. about the restaurant on the moon? There's great food, but no atmosphere. Oh, it's good to have some jokes on hand. If only I had a joke book to write them down in. Do you want to sit here with your friends? Yes. The moon looks gigantic from here. This is the most beautiful place I've ever seen. There's so much litter around. How can you say it's beautiful? Aubrey, Aubrey, don't be such a wet blanket. Look at things on the bright side. You know what I always say? Just gotta wake up and smell the roses. You don't always say that. Oh, there's nothing there. Oh no. This dial up sad. Come <laughs> on. 
that's funny. Maybe Aubrey should be Scout. Since so she's got the bat. No good. Can't even tint this thing. Hmm. Hold on a sec. This is cheese, isn't it? Whoa, you're right. It is cheese. Okay, guys. Hear me out. Might sound crazy, but what if we eat the cheese? We all start now. We'll probably finish this in a couple hours or so. Morning though, cheese gets me kind of gassy. Ew, Cal. What up, Cal? There's no need for that. I think I may have the perfect solution. Tag me, Amori. I know just how to handle this. Hello friends, it's me, Ems, the, humbry, the humble hungry hamster. Oh wow, is this all for me? What a treat. How'd you know that cheese is my favorite? I don't have to guess, Ems. Everything is your favorite. Everyone, this is Emily the hamster, but I just call her Ems. She's a good friend of mine. You know what to do, Ems. I sure do. Down in a jiffy. all that even fit her body. Beats me. I try not to think about it. That was incredibly satisfying. If you're ever in need of any giant cheese eating services again, you know who to call. Goodbye, friends. Okay. That was weird. How are we supposed to find anything in here? There's just way too much junk. Wait, were we looking for something? Oh ho 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 ho! At long last, I finally found it! After countless hours of digging and digging, this one of a kind, ultra exclusive special mixtape finally belongs to me, Rosa, the number one sweetheart band in the world. This one-of-a-kind addition to my collection, I will finally surpass all those lame posters out there. Wait. Oh no. Special mixtape. Smells like doo-doo. Oh no. I smell like doo-doo. Hold on, did she say she found a special mixtape? That's what we've been looking for. Oh yeah. Let's go get it. I can hear everything you're saying. Just as I suspected, owning something so valuable is already getting me into trouble. Oh, ho, 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 ho. What's the matter? Are you jealous? This special mixtape is mine. I'll never give it to you. Not now, not ever. Hey, we didn't come out all the way all the way out here for nothing. You don't give us that special mixtape, we'll have to take it by force. Hey, such savage behavior. Violence never solved anything, you know. Hm. I'm much too refined for this nonsense. Farewell, peons. See you never. Wait, come back here. Wait, oh, Mori, after. We can't let her get away. You'll never catch me, stick legs. We got rain cloud and ramen. Hmm. 
Yeah, watch him call it. Yeah, computer part. Ah, yes. Perfectly risky. Like to eat some? Yes. You and your friends feel like new. No, I meant to talk to Mari. I see you're keeping yourselves busy. I hope you're all having a fun adventure. The only Mary, don't forget you can rest up at my picnics. Big sister is always prepared. Rosa, we finally caught you. Now give us back that special mixtape. What's with her? Hey, Rosa, can you hear us? Huh? I wonder why she isn't responding. Let's take a closer look. <laughs> I just... Rosa's not responding. <laughs> Ah, 
I didn't mean to do that. I don't have enough juice. just happened. Who cares? We gotta take back that special mixtape. You took the special mixtape from Rosa. Huh? What in the world? Hey, that's mine. Give it back. No way. It's finders keepers. Putting this back in Space Boyfriend's boombox where it belongs. Hmm? Space Boyfriend. You say. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Oh, you ignorant child. Haven't you heard the latest news? I have a very reputable source who tells me that Space Boyfriend and Sweetheart have long since parted ways. Why do you think this special mixtape is in the junkyard in the first place? Because Space Boyfriend threw it away himself. Space Boyfriend threw away the special mixtape himself. Uh-oh. That's not good. But if Space Boyfriend and Sweetheart aren't together anymore, how will we ever wake up, Space Boyfriend, now? The future of the once great coalition of space pirates is depending on us. <laughs> that sounds like your problem, not mine. Wait just a second. How do we know you're not lying about all this? You could just be trying to get the special mixtape back. Well, I never. I may be rude and pretentious, but I'm not a liar. Like we trust you. I think we'll just keep the special mixtape and see for ourselves. Now scram, you ugly plant creature. Go bother someone else. Oh my, so rude. You'll pay for this, stupid boy. Mark my words. Did I? Like I forgot something here. There's something, there's a, uh, the equipment for a hero in here. The thing that lets hero learn snack time. right there. Ow. Fiddlesticks.
Oh, I need to go out that way. How do I get there?
Oops. get there. Scarecrow. I am stuck in the ground. Crow feeds at me and hear a strange sound. Bonk. Wasn't that fun? Come again another day and try again. You can stop now. This is really starting to hurt. Please, stop it. Stop now, I'm gonna to have to report you to the authorities. Yeah, what authorities is that? Please, stop. I'm asking you politely. Stop it. Stop it right now, I say. just mean nothing to you, I see. <sighs> I remember when people used to listen to me. You know, back in high school, everyone used to make fun of me for no having no legs. They'd say things like, Oh look, it's Scarecrow standing in the same spot like he always does. Let's use him for target practice. Ooh, kids are so mean. Like, really, really horrible. <laughs> You're just throwing balls at me. What 
do I even have to complain about? This is nothing compared to what I used to go through. I always start small, you know. First it was rubber bands, then rubber balls. I remember once a kid even threw a desk at me. Yeah, that's right. I took an entire desk head on. I used to tell myself if I could survive that, I could survive anything. Now see, if I had hands, we could play catch. Here, throw me the ball. I'll try to catch it. Darn. I guess it slipped right through my fingers. Haha. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll get it next time. Oh, I almost had that one. I was very close, did you see? Come on, try it again. Haha. <laughs> ah, man, good times. Could it be that I don't have real arms either? I wonder. <sighs> I wish I could move. I could travel the world, settle down with someone I love, start a family. No, it's dangerous to dream so recklessly. Why must I be stuck here? Am I not allowed to have anything nice? Why is fate so cruel? What did I do wrong? It's not fair. I hate this. Ah, what's this feeling? I think I'm crying. Am I crying? I don't have tear ducts, so I can't tell. Just forget I said any of this, okay? They call me Scarecrow. I am stuck in the ground. Throw things at me, and hear a strange sound. Okay. Well, I got back to the beginning of the dialogue, so I think I did all of it. I don't wanna I don't wanna do that right now. What's the uh What's the thing in the corner of the border supposed to be? left corner. Looks kind of like Peter Griffin. <laughs> you know, I want to find out what are my other uh, screen borders. Amori. Aubrey. Kel, Hero, Mari, Basil, Sun. Find your art. Alas, I have found art in a most unexpected place. The madam will surely be pleased. No, 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 no.
Lovely weather, isn't it? Hold it right there. Finally found you, Pluto. There's no escape. Good snailing. Oh no, my gigantic, well-defined arms and legs are giving out. I can't let it in like this. I need to find a hiding place. Hey, you there. Please, lend me your assistance. Oh, uh, well, uh, hurry. I don't have much time. You need a place to hide, huh? Ah, I got it. Rest easy now. I got this all under control. Okay, that should do it. Shoot, they're coming. Quick, everyone, act natural. <sighs> Damn it, we lost them. Hey, you kids, we're looking for a high-profile and very expensive rogue planet named Pluto. Big, circular, grayish guy with huge, bulging muscles. Kinda hard to miss. Have you seen him? No? Can't say we have. Really? Well, that's life. Come on, dude, let's keep searching. We'll find him eventually. Okay, sir, coast is clear. Wahahaha! <laughs> Such quick thinking. I'm impressed. You have my eternal gratitude. What are your names, if I may ask? I'm Hiro, and these are my friends Aubrey, Cal, and Amori. I see. Fine names for fine young people. My name is Pluto, and I am a rogue planet. A vagabond, if you will. I do apologize for causing everyone so much trouble, but I feel that it's not my purpose to act as a mere yard decoration. I want the freedom to roam the sky as I please, like the birds and the stars. If that makes me a rogue planet, then so be it. They can call me what they please, so long as I'm free to do as I please. My soul yearns for freedom. You understand, don't you, children? Oh, Kel, are you crying? Such raw emotion. I'm touched. This beautiful Pluto. You said it, Kel. Wait, you too, Aubrey? Now, at long last, I am finally free to follow my lifelong dream of running my own transportation company. I'm going to call it Pluto's Space Line. <laughs> this realization has reinvigorated me. And since you have helped me in such a selfless way, I must return the favor. <laughs> Pluto, Pluto's Space Line. Please pretend you have just arrived at the transportation station. Oh, okay. Uh, hello, Pluto. Greetings from Pluto's space line. Where would you like to go today, young travelers? Gah! Oh, was that too much? Hmm. Let's try to turn it down. Let's try this again. No, it's okay. We'd just like to go back to the campsite, please. So, you want to go to the other world campsite? Ah, my first request. How exciting! Oh no, here it comes. <laughs> One ride to Otherworld Campsite coming right up. I won't let you down, young travelers. Leave the rest to me. Is everyone strapped in? Wait, hold on, I'm not ready yet. Welcome to Pluto's Space Line. Where will your journey take you? So, you want to go to Otherworld? Yes, you got it. Just sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride. <laughs> How was that for a smooth ride? Comfortable environment and relaxing music? I'd give it five out of five stars. <laughs> Says you, I can't even feel my arms anymore. Kel, I have to say, 
You did a great job holding on for dear life back then. You have the potential to be very strong. Let me teach you a skill that might be useful in the future. <laughs> Feet after me. When I flex, I feel my best. Now you try. When I flex, I feel my best. Whoa, that felt amazing. I'm pumped. Hmm. Could use a little work. But nevertheless, you definitely got the power within you. Take this lesson and use it well. Farewell, children. Until next time. Cal learned flex. Ah, yes. Ugly space tube. I think I'm going to take a break for a little bit. So. Let's go back to the title screen. Let's see if I... No, not that. Did I get new badges? I'll have four. And then... Got one for defeating Pluto. One for gaining bread. Listen to Mr. Scarethor's rant. That's it. Alright. Oh. Thank you to my one viewer. And I'll probably come back in... Mm, an hour. And we'll pick up from there. Alright. So I'll see y'all then.